everyone, and welcome back, finally, to Prognostic. I've been really, 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 really wanting to finish this series for a while, but at first the game hadn't fully come out yet. Let me actually get the audio back up. Yeah, at first the game had, like, had not published the rest of its chapters, and then I didn't see the update for a while. So I kept going like, oh, when is it going to happen? When is it going to happen? When are we going to get the last chapters? And finally, I noticed it, but when I put it up on my Discord voting poll, they uh, nobody voted on it. So I was like, I'm just going to have to sit here and twiddle my thumbs and wait until somebody picks this game. But they finally have, so we are going to actually play through the very last chapters. I think I have three chapters left? But they're gonna make me replay through day 12. I forgot that that's how this goes. I think the last thing that happened was I got knocked out by a mysterious visitor. And now we get to figure out how this whole story is going to end. So yeah, I think I have to replay chapter 12 or day 12, the runaway. Let's see if any of this is familiar, because I don't remember how to play this game. Um, okay, this looks vaguely familiar. Are you okay to see a body at once? Oh, okay, yep. It must be shocking. We were trying to establish dead girl's identity, but so far unsuccessfully. I'll tell you right away, your alibi was confirmed. You're in the clear. Oh, my poor brother. I remember. Yeah. Yep, yep, bad things happened at the end. Okay, so the escape took place at 1400 at the stables at 17 Pinner Street. The prison escort was killed by Cook's accomplice. The girl whose body lay at your doorstep was killed on the same day. So, do we actually know the day or no? Okay, um, same day. Okay, let's see. So we have to send where escaped George Cook is now. So the fifth. So I'm assuming this is the fourth? Send the dossier of the killer who helped Cook escape. Send the dowsing trait, the second dowsing trait. Okay, so these are two. Yeah. Yeah, these are our two victims, and these are the suspects. Okay. Tab close. So this, this is gonna be fun, because I don't remember how to play this game. Okay, so... Okay, it is lit. Wait. The, uh, the bullet flew right next to me. Two feet closer and I would be dead. I still can't believe it. Will it be that lucky next time? I'm not sure. I thought about it for a long time and decided to write you a letter just in case. I can see how this house is pulling the soul out of you. Every day you're digging through dirt, death, and madness. This leads to gloomy thoughts, deprives you of hope. But I met people who survived only thanks to you. You are not suffering in vain. Remember you are my best friend. You're all I've got left. I'm proud of you. Sincerely, your brother. Uh, have you already guessed who helped me escape? Okay, so that's a note about the case. I should not lean so close to my computer because I'm going to get scared. Okay, okay. So, no, that's the Wheel of Thanatos. I need this one. Okay, just, that's me. It's okay. Okay. Okay, I can hear it. It sounds... Okay, it is coming from upstairs. <laughs> I forgot about that already! Yeah, so now we have the weird vision where all the stuffed animals are staring at me. Where are the dowsing rods leading me? Yes, no... Okay, so it's a... It's a black pair of pants? 
Okay, this is a black shirt. He will give us eternity. Okay, so is it... Okay, it is actually pointing to the shirt. I have been duped before. And this door is now shut. Okay. So... What was it? It was clothes? We'll tell you the color of the hair. So it was a black shirt, which means it is black hair. And now we switch this out with her. Okay, where is she going to lead us? Okay, here. Oh, this is, so this is where we found the body. This is my welcoming gift. Uh, you don't sound very welcoming at all. Okay, black, it's a black toy. I'm trying to listen for any whispering. Okay. Toys show us the color of the murderer's eyes. Okay. So, we can rule out this guy, because he's blonde. He has black eyes, but he has blonde hair. She cannot be ruled out. He can be ruled out, because he has blue eyes. I guess I should have actually read through these. Oh, wait, no. Okay, so he is... Is it Evan? He's a fugitive, which was arrested by Ranger Elliot a couple years ago. Now he was arrested by us. We found him at the scene of the crime with a revolver in his hands. Evan does not deny that he was going to get revenge on the Ranger, but claims that someone got to Elliot before him. Well, he's innocent, so we know he was telling the truth. Uh, Danielle is Elliot's ex-girlfriend. The first thing the Ranger did when he arrived in town was to meet her. Danielle said that she went to the stable only to say... To say him goodbye. Yeah, they needed to check their their uh, English a little bit. Uh, so this is Patrick Owen. This vagabond was detained next to your house near the girl's body. We didn't get much from him. Only incoherent phrases about figures in the night. Well, he's innocent anyway. Mr. Ben. Ben Roberts. He is not innocent. That we know of at the moment. Robert is a musician who recently settled down in our town. Uh, he was seen near the stable during the time of the murder. He says he went there to leave our town, but Cook might as well have bribed him to get out. Interesting. Uh, George is the, the bad guy. And Patrick Whitney. I, th I think he was the one who was working for the police, but then got no, or is it George? The, uh, both of them were working with the cops, but I, it might have been George that was the one who it was, because he's the one who got arrested. Um, yeah, he got fired and then ended up trying to kill the police chief. But Patrick also works for the police. Oh, no, he's the one who got fired. George is the one who still worked there. But I think he's, he's the one who tried to kill the guy. Uh, we found out that Patrick was indeed fired last month, but he continues to come to work and make scandals. He also showed up at the scene of the ranger's murder as if he wanted to investigate it himself. It seems that he is starting to have problems with perception with the perception of reality. Well, he might be guilty, so that makes sense. Okay, what do we... Dowsing trait, second dowsing trait, got that... Send Elliot's tarot. Okay, so we need to go do Elliot's tarot reading. That's not. It's not creepy at all. Okay. Well, tarot is. Oh, stupid jump scare. That's runes. I need tarot cards. Occasionally, there's someone in the room, so had to check. Okay, uh, was it? I think it was. Send Elliot. Yeah, that's him. 
Okay, okay. What is what does this say? He is locked away beyond the edge of nothingness. Our savior is waiting. This just gets creepier by the moment. Okay, shuffle. Okay, which card am I oh no, no. Which card am I waiting for? Justice. Oh dang it. I'm like having PTSD because I remember the jump scares. Okay, calm yourself with the noises. Oh crap. King of Mirrors is waiting. Okay. Yeah, no, this game just gets creepier all the time. Okie dokie, and we're back. So we're looking for justice. <laughs> Why you do such hateful things? You know what? You know what? I'm gonna redraw because I got the devil three times and I'm pretty sure that killed me last time. So we're gonna do it again. There we go. I almost fell for it. Okay, so the emperor. The killer is a man. The killer's a dude. Which means she is innocent. Which means it was either Ben or Patrick. Okay. There's like a. Ref oh, why is there squishy sounds? Oh, I don't like that. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, I remember this distinctly. I had a jump scare right here. He sheltered the lost, let him in, bring them back. I remember. Okay, so we definitely need George's. And it was from the hour 20, December 5th. Okay, so hour 20, month 12, day 5. And I'm assuming that that is the year. Okay, where are you now? Okay, so that's right. Okay, when... Okay, so the escape took place at 1400. Was this last night? I think it was last night. So if I go back... Okay, so... Prison escort was killed by Cook's accomplice. So, theoretically, if we go and go to this time... So, I'm assuming that was yesterday, and it's, what, hour 14? Okay, so this took place at Pinner, which means George should have been there. No? Yes? No? Wait. Did I just confuse it? I think I did. No, wait, now I'm confused. Oh, yep, st 17 pinner. I was, I was thinking seven because it was the one that was circled. Okay, but we know where he was. Where was Ben? Ooh, Ben was at 14 pinner. And where was Mr. Patrick? At 17 pinner. Who would have thought? And then at... Uh, they're closing doors again. Okay, so... I'm gonna say right now, he is the murderer. But... The girl whose body lay at my doorstep was killed on the same day at 23. 
I'm just curious. I don't think I ever figured out where my address is. Oh, shoot. Oh, crap. It wasn't that mirror. Where is she manifesting? Oh, shoot. Oh, boy. I think she got faster, too. Ah! Nope. Nope. Shoot, 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 nanny. Move! Hi, Grandma! How nice to see you! Can, can you, uh... Can I get past you? Jesus! No, she's right there. Show oh, shoot. What is happening? She's everywhere. Oh, and the lightning doesn't help. Oh, Grandma. Oh, Grandma, no. Can you, like, move? I don't want to get close to you, Grandma. Can I need I need to get to that mirror, but if I go too close, she's gonna get me. Why is she not moving? Can I just like safely go about my day? Uh grandma? You know what? You know what? Okay, you just stay there. I'm pretty sure I've got the evidence I need. Okay. It was this dude. The first dowsing trait. Uh, killer has black hair. Killer has black eyes. And Elliot's tarot. Fan sent? Why can't I send it? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I need to... There we go. There we go. Yes? Grandma glitched out on me. I'm sorry, but your brother can't answer you anymore. I've already visited him. But don't get upset. I can be your new friend. You found us both. I'm impressed. You're truly the one who can hear the departed. You have a lot to learn and to do. But first, I've prepared a gift for you. New case. Oh. You know, generally speaking, uh, you're not supposed... Yeah, there we go. I just got clocked. How lovely. Okay, so now we're in a new chapter, and I have a new friend who murdered my brother. Oh no, why? I don't like these ones. These ones scare me. Okay, so well, everything's dark behind me. Forgive me my sin. Is somebody gonna be. Oh, oh, hi, Grandma! Grandma? Oh, oh no. Grandma, no! Oh. Oh boy. He forced me. She's gonna come out of the mirror. I just, I feel it deep in my bones. Like, that, that is my instinct, is she's going to come through one of these mirrors. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Come on! Why do you keep doing this to me? I'm scared enough as it is. We've been tainted by his thoughts. Oh! Oh, it's the creepy guy that was in my basement. Please? There's... Oh no. I hear something. Who is that? It sounds like somebody's digging a grave. Don't bring us back. Where's that sound coming from? I was right! 
Somebody's digging a grave. Oh god, this is creepy. I appreciate the attention to detail though, but like, ugh. Something tells me I'm gonna scream in this episode too. Don't let him in. Are we gonna like infinite mirror glitch or something? Oh. Well, somebody already let him in. He was in my basement. He is coming. Well, no, he's already here and he's in my basement. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, God, he grabbed me. Ew. He makes wet noises. Day 13. First death. No, there's been a lot of people dying here. Oh, boy. Unknown Anderson. It's <laughs> a weird name for a kid. Here is my gift. I've prepared a new case for you. A young family, an immigrant, his wife, and two sons. One night, a murderer sneaks into their house and leaves their son without parents. Familiar? The moment that changed your life. So who is to blame? Oh, so am I one of the Andersons? Or why does Robert look like the guy that was in the last case? Are these my parents? Is this me? Because I don't... We don't know my name. Is this Grandma? I have questions. I swear... I've seen this one, too. <gasps> That's because I have! I think he's the... He's the chief of police, maybe? Or the mayor or somebody. Back when the Brooks... Uh, back when Brooks was just a simple officer, he found two boys locked in an apartment with their dead parents. When your brother decided to join the police force... Brooks took him under his wing. He worked with your grandmother in the past, and he knew what you were cap you would be capable of. Uh, he used you just like everyone else. I feel like since this was written by the, the person who knocked me out, the culty person, I feel like this is deliberately antagonistic towards Brooks. Why didn't she talk to her mother? Oh, yep, this is her mom. So, why didn't she tell you about your grandma? I don't know, but our king allowed me to... Okay, well, that answered my question. If I did things in order like I was supposed to... Um, let's see, but our king allowed me to speak with her. She told me how she asked you not to tell anyone about the voices. Do you want to talk to her once more? <laughs> Age is dead. Mm -hmm. Okay. Robert Anderson. I'm assuming that's my dad. He worked all his life to provide for his family's future. Like many people, he did not notice the threads of the higher purpose behind the routine. I spoke to him thanks to the king, and you know what? Even he heard your whispers at night. It makes me wonder if he ever regretted marrying your mother. So it's our mom that is related to our weird able to talk to the dead grandmother which apparently has transferred down to me. Unknown Anderson. Yep, this is me. I'm Unknown Anderson. Uh, I couldn't find your portrait, couldn't even get your name out of your brother until recently. I doubted that you'd even existed. It's nice to see you in person. <laughs> uh, he's done more than I'm only 19! I'm 19 and I'm being put through this! That's not okay! How old's, how old's my brother? Is he my older- he's my older brother. Age- age minus one. That doesn't make any sense. He's my older brother, but he's age minus one. Oh. Oh, he died. That, oh, that, that hurts my heart that I just, this is how I find out that my brother died. So, yep, he died December 12th, or the, no, that's the month. So December 6th. Oh, wow. Things have not been going well for me. Uh, your older brother, what was he like as a child? The same arrogant, sarcastic asshole. Uh, don't speak ill of my brother. You murdered him. Is that it? That's my grandma. Your grandma, what a kind, selfless person. She sheltered you, raised you, gave you a purpose. She always had big plans for you. But how early did she start bringing them to life? Um. Okay, so who's this? Mrs. Fulton was your neighbor. Wasn't she one of the people who died? Yeah. Wait. 1905. 
I thought it was 1904. How long have I been asleep? Because the last thing I knew was my, my brother died on December 6th. And now all of a sudden she is dead. So is this in the future? Is she going to die? Or don't... How long was I knocked out? That is a darn good question. Um, yeah, she was your neighbor and even looked after you from time to time. She listened to your stories about weird dreams and imaginary friends. It was you who introduced her to the voice of God. Thirteen years later, Annabel Fulton sacrificed her own grandson as a gift to the voice. Oh. The King of Mirrors asked her and she answered voluntarily. But was it, but was her grandson the first victim? What? Uh, Bruno Richards. He dabbled in, the, in petty theft in the neighboring streets. He was detained by a younger policeman named Davin, the future chief of police. Okay, so Davin was the chief of police, who was almost murdered? Uh, whom you helped out so much. Richards was arrested based on suspicion of killing your parents. The next year he was executed. I'm assuming he's not actually the one responsible because they're like, oh, who murdered your parents? Yeah, this guy is probably not the one responsible. Find out who killed your parents. Find the clue using the tarot cards. Find the clue by contacting your mother with the what? I can actually talk to people with the dowsing rods? How does that work? Uh, find a clue by contacting your father with the dowsing rods. Mark and send where the killer was at the hour of the crime. Okie dokie. There's going to be more jump scares. I can feel it. Okay, so let's go up to the tarot cards. I'm imagining I'll die a couple times here. Okay. First, my mother. Mom, what do you have to say? Justice. That was fast. The Fool. So, what? Zero? Cards are silent. The bond is unknown. Dang it, Mom! You didn't help me at all. Dad? Dad? Are you... Help a boy out. Come on. The Fool. Gosh dang it! My parents are not helpful from beyond the grave. Uh, can I get my tarot reading? The chariot. Okay, we're, we're getting somewhere. The magician. Are you going to give me the entire deck again? The empress. Strength. Oh my gosh. They're going to be like, we don't have an answer for you because you're still alive. Ah, justice! Dang it! <laughs> I was catfished! Okay, well that didn't work. Bro, you, you are you gonna help me out? Justice! Strength! Okay, so he has a number eight. Eight, eight, eight. The deceased was strangled or beaten. That's, that's terrible. Oh, gosh dang it. I didn't mean to click that one and you know it. Okay, uh, Grandma. So what I want to know is, does she keep coming through the mirror so that the King of Mirrors doesn't? And who, is, who or what is the King of Mirrors? These are the questions. The hanged man. So that's 12. Death was a suicide. Okay, so grandma committed suicide. We had figured that earlier, but it's been confirmed. Ann Fulton. Okay, where... Okay, cover! Jesus! Oh, okay, I always hate it when the house makes the, like, the growling sound. 
Okay. Um. Okay, I was in the middle of shuffling the cards. Whew, boy. I am tense. Okay, the world, 21. Wait, what? She's still alive. See, so, okay, now I'm confused because her date of death has been sealed. I will not scream, I will not scream, I will not scream. Okay. So that is so weird that he's marked down her date of death. So she's marked for death, just hasn't died yet. Interesting. I called it, though. Mm, stop breaking things. You don't live here. Okay. Uh, justice. So this one's pretty easy. Uh, five. The murderer is a politician or a policeman. Well, I mean, okay. So technically speaking, if he was executed, like, uh, like, death penalty... Yeah, I can understand. That would be an officer or politician. Okay, come on. Justice. What does Brooks have to say? The chariot. Seven. The killer is a colleague. I thought we already figured out... Because now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure I, he was murdered and I was investigating his murder. Okie dokie! Uh, okay, so we found... The... There's way too many clues, I just realized that. But, okay, so this one's not really important. This one might be important. Not so important. Okay, so was this all the same person? So, he was with the police, I think. Was he? Yes. No? Y yes. So, okay, so he's with the police, and he was killed by George. He was executed. It just says executed. Like, it, did, they, it didn't say, like, put to death or anything. So I don't know the circumstances of his murder. So is the person responsible for these deaths this person? Okay, Grandma. I got it. Oh, this makes me uncomfortable. Okay. Okay, Mom, where are you leading? Is it... Oh... Crap! Dang it's downstairs! Wait, yes? Yep, yes, no. Oh! And she manifested! Hi, Grandma! So lovely to see you! Okay, at least she's moving this time. That that door just shut and that scared the crap out of me. Hey grandma, where are you going? I, I don't like that I can't tell exactly where she is. Why does that sound close? I didn't like because she went through here so she could have been like sneaking around me 
Okay. Back to you, Mom. Where are you leading me? Is it... See, this is what confuses me. Okay, so hers is the clock. Oh, there's so many doors. Okay. So a clock? The murderer is 30... Oh, gosh dang it. Oh, I am not doing so hot with these jump scares. My whole body is clenching so tight. Okay. One of these days I will finish the dowsing. The murderer is 35 years or older. Uh, okay. So, that rules out. You're a victim. Oh, wait. So, at the time, they weren't dead. Okay, but... So, he's not ruled out because he's 41. He's not ruled out because he's 45. Obviously her. Okay, my brother at the time was not that old. So my brother's innocent. He didn't kill my parents. Okay. That, that didn't help me at all. It just ruled out my brother. Okay, why don't you... There we go. But how old was he at the time? That, I guess, is going to be the question, because how old was he? Okay, let me do some math, because I don't know if this is giving me the age that he was at the time of the murder, or what. So he was born in 1863, and my parents died in 18... 1891. He was only 28 at the time. So he is innocent. How old? So you are... Okay, well, we'll just do the math again. And if I'm wrong about this, then so be it. 1859 minus... 1891. Okay, he was 32, so he's still on the suspect list. I was gonna say, normally whenever you get the um, the dowsing rods, they only cancel one suspect at a time. Okie dokie. So now, Dad, what you got for me? Green dinosaur? I guess if I'm wrong, it'll let me know. Okay. So, toy is the eye color. Okay, so that was right. So, Joan has green eyes. Bruno has green eyes. She has green eyes. Who did that take off? Like, nobody. Okay. Way to go, Dad. Yep, green, green, green. 
Even I'm still a, well. No, okay, I'm not a suspect anymore. I'm innocent. I didn't murder my parents. Okie dokie. So we still have those three. No, no. Maybe they didn't expect me to do the math and figure out that at the time of my parents' death he wasn't that old. So it was like, oh, he's got blue eyes. He's innocent. I was ahead of the curve. Wait, what? That doesn't make any sense. The date of death is November 20th, 1863. Well, he was born in 1863, so apparently that didn't work. Yeah, no, that doesn't work, but uh. okay. <sighs> I got those that mark and set okay so now I guess we use this one let's dark oh oh no what have you done to my map what how is that fair oh shoot Ah, well, at least she's just right there. Excuse you. I need to know who's defaced my map. What? That is cheap. Do I have to just do it on the floor now? Probably. Okay, Mom, when did you die? December... First, 1891. Do we know the hour? Ah, gosh dang it, Will of Thanatos. Yep. I knew it. I knew it wouldn't be this simple. Gotta do the wheel. Okay. Dear departed mother. Okie dokie. Mom was born June 6th. Okay. Um, Ju she's a Gemini. Okay. Key letter of the name. Third letter of the name. Whoa, I'm getting all sorts out of order. No, no, I'm good. Okay. The third letter of the name, or the first if the name has less than three letters. Okay, so... Third B. B is two, so that is red wheel. Okay, work with me. Um which one's the one that shoots okay, this one. Gemini it's like I'm not Okay, there we go. Okay, and then if there are more than five letters in the surname, the key letter of the surname... <sighs> Stupid. I feel like those don't last as long. Oh, the blood's gone. Lovely. How nice that my new special friend... Hi, Grandma. How nice that my new special friend cleaned it up for me. Okay, the breathing is new and I don't like it. Okay. It's more than five letters. Um, is the fifth one. One, two, three, four, five, R. R is two. Okay. So, hour, nighttime, 11, that's 23. Day, oh shoot. Did I get it closed in time? I did. Is that a dog barking? What? Grandma, I'm trying to figure out who murdered your daughter. Okay. 
Well, it looks right, because it's 12-1. 12... No. 12-1. What's the year? 1864. 1860. What? No. Day 1. Month 12. Hour 11. Which it says night time. Why did I do that wrong? 11 p.m. would be 23, because midnight would be 12. 1891. Why did I do 64? Oh, because I did her birth year. Mm. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Yeah, there we go. Did Dad die at the same time? Did... So helpful, father of mine! Okay, well, now that we have the date and time, I guess... That's weird. It like I feel like it took it took over for a second. Okay. So mom, it was hour 23 month 12 day 1 18 I should have gone the other way. Nights 91. There we go. Eh. That's helpful. Well, that's where mom was. Wherever the knife was. <gasps> Grandma, was it you? These. <clears throat> Go away, Grandma. Stop making the candles go out. You're making me nervous. Grandma, did you murder my parents? Oh, boy. I feel like I'm not going to make this one in time. Hi, Grandma. Go away, Grandma. Can I just please... F Grandma, why are you everywhere? Go away! I feel like I'm unlocking something very, very bad. <sighs> Grandma, you murdered my parents! You old bat! Why'd you do it? <laughs> what? Is my grandma all along? Wow, that's that's awful. Okay. Apparently it was my grandma. I find the clue using the Okay, which one of these clues is prudent? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, well, okay. Well, no, I guess I guess James's murder doesn't really have anything to do with it. Um, which ones all came from the tarot cards? Oh, he worked with her. Is that why that you're saying it was a colleague? I was thinking police officer. This one threw me off because I was like, oh, it was probably a police officer. But he, it says specifically in his dossier that he worked with my grandmother. Oh, sneaky! Okay, uh, what did my mom say? My mom said 35 years old or older. Dad said killer had green eyes. Mark and said, oh, that makes sense about the whole the grandma had plans for you and how early did it start? Oh, no, Grandma, why? Uh, and she was in the old house. I, I'm kind of hoping I'm not right. Are, uh, are you incapable of knowing who is guilty? Or are you just unwilling to admit the truth? K 
king needs a man with a strong... Okay, so I... It wasn't this one. Okay. So I can go through... I'm gonna have to go through parts of it again. Okay. So I got everything right except for the tarot card. So... Uh, Wheel of Thanatos, no. I get confused in this house. I was going for the dowsing rod, but completely wrong side of the house. Okay. So, let's fake it till we make it. Mom said that it was that. Dad said Killer had green eyes. Okay, what else do we need? tarot card and mark and send where the killer was the hour of the crime. Okay, that one I can fake too. I just need to find out the tarot one that makes sense. Okay, um... I need to know where you were. Hour 23 month 12, day 1, 1991. Why are you not? Oh gosh dang it, it's because his file is still on the, the dowsing. Take this off. Okay, well, I've already done that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we'll pull dads back up here. Gosh dang it. Okay, I get it. Why am I not allowed to take off? <clears throat> Thanks for that. Okay, why am I not allowed? What am I missing? Come on. Did I break it? I feel like I did. Okay. Why are we not wanting to work anymore? Okay, where was mom? Dang it. Am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Okay. Ugh, it's still pointing me there. How to take it off? Fix me, saucy on the stand. Okay. Yeah, I get it. But for some reason, it's not letting me move on. I swear I just broke the game. Because now it's not letting me move on. Can we try this again? Okay, did I... Is it 1994? No. 18, that's why. Um... Go away, Grandma. You murdered my parents. I'm not too happy with you. 
Okay, so now we need the tarot readings. But like I said, I don't know which one is going to work for it. That's that's runes. That's runes. I always get the two sides of the house confused. Okay. I don't think it's James. She's still alive. What is what was his again? No, his was that it was Okay, that whispering was also new. Sounded different. <sighs> Gotta fake it again. You know what? We'll just start here. Okay, Grandma. Hour twenty-three. Month. Day one. Eighteen. 91. You are in the house. We all know this. I know this. They know this. Dowsing rod. Okay. Mom is going to tell us age. Dad is going to tell us eye color. Back upstairs! Mom and Dad gave me diddly squat on the cards. And that's runes again. Gosh dang it. Okay. What is yours going to say? Isn't this the person who's still alive? The tower... Justice! Okay, hers was 21 the world. Person is still alive. Okay, put the cards back. Put the cards back. <sighs> Let me try that again. Because I swear... I, mm, okay, so his... Maybe it was dad, because I think I stopped just because it said the fool. You don't scare me. The Empress. Number three. The killer is a woman. That's gotta be it, because like I said, I think I stopped too soon. Okay. Person who killed my parents. Dowsing trait from mom. Dowsing trait from dad. Dad said it's a woman. Yes? Ah! Now you know all of it. We didn't destroy your family. She did it. Your grandmother couldn't find the strength to go against him. She needed a successor. One who is connected with death since childhood, but is able to act on his own. She has been manipulating you since you were a kid, but we are not like that. The king gives us a choice. It's not an order, but an opportunity to bring your family back. The mirrors told me not to bring anybody back. Do you want this? Then go downstairs. They told me not to do it! <laughs> Am I? Okay, I'm in control. Oh, someone's tap tap tapping on the door! I don't like that. Can I, can I open any of the... Oh, I can't open any of the doors. Can I just leave? Nope, negatory captain. 
So they're not giving me a choice. Like, I can't go this way because there's a shelf in the way. That door's locked. They're, they're telling me to go down into that basement. He gives you a chance. This isn't a chance! I literally have no choice! I don't want to! I don't want to deal with the murderer! Let me out! <sighs> well then. Creeptastic! I don't wanna... Is there... Is there seriously no other way out? Can I, can I move anything? Can I... Nope! Down to the creepy basement we go! Of course, there's no one there. <sighs> Either that was wood breaking or it was my uh, ankles, but... Oh, how nice! You know I half expected those doors to shut. You'll no longer be alone. Oh, oh. Whoa, getting some weird vibes. I mean, if the if the murder basement did ar didn't already, I swear. If... Okay, I'm getting amnesia vibes. That's what's happening. Oh look, there's blood. I think that's what's happening. Is I'm getting amnesia vibes. Let your family in. I feel like this is all a ploy. Because they want Grandma to come back. Oh, who's that? Are there just more pictures of my family? Yeah, I don't know why. That, just that, uh, when it goes, like, gray and fizzy like that, I get, I get, uh, amnesia vibes. Smash the mirrors. What? Okay, whoa there. Whoa there. Who is telling me to smash the mirrors? And is that going to let him in or keep him out? So much more blood! <laughs> Hello, Lady Octopus! I'm in the murder ba- Oh, so much blood. I'm in the murder basement. It's lovely. You know what? I'm going to take a brief pause real quick and I'm going to add your point today as well as Diz Nerds from the other day. I don't like the murder basement. So, I, I, oh wow, that's, that's a lot of stairs. I've been having, oh god! Why did that scare me? Oh, 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 oh no, oh, oh, it's a mirror. I thought it was going to be the monster again. Wait, wait, what? Wait, what? Oh! Okay, so th these these are my family members. And it wants me to break the glass. But earlier I was warned not to let them in. So I don't know how to avoid this. Do I just run away? Apparently Grandma murdered my family. My... My... Uh, mom and my dad. My brother was murdered. Well, he was strangled to death. I found that out. Um, I don't want to let them back in because I feel by letting them back in, I'm only going to bring the King of Mirrors and I don't want to. So I don't. Can I just. I can't run away! No. What if I just sit here? I, I can mull around in the, the, the blood river for a little while. Yeah, I can't, I can't. Oh. Let her out, drown your mother. What? What? No! I, well, she's already dead, so what's gonna happen? But still, I, I don't, I don't. I don't wanna let them out, but drowning them sounds awful. <laughs> Drown your grandmother, let your grandmother out. I don't want her to come back and my poor my poor brother 
He was murdered for no good reason. I guess, I guess I'm going to drown them because I don't want to let them out because I feel like by opening the mirrors, that's just going to let out the king of mirrors. And I don't want to do that. Bye, dad. I'm sorry. Bye, mom. Bye. Bye, big brother. Grandma, you started this all! I don't feel bad about letting you drown, but... Did... Did I make the right choice? Is the monster going... Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Did drowning them let him out? Or... Wait. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm so confused! Oh, oh! The King of Mirrors! Oh, he's coming out! Oh, he's coming out of the- No! Help! Wait, did I- Did I drown him? Did it- Did it work? What- Oh, it's turning back to water. What? I'm still not in control. Did I die? Did I die and this is a fever dream? Was that it? Was that it? That, that... That doesn't make any sense to me for some odd reason. I feel like that doesn't make any sense because they were all about the King of Mirrors and he's gotta come back and I'm like, okay, like, but why? And it never really explained, like, so was Grandma working with the King of Mirrors? Or did she actually... Why did my brother have to die? Did, did Grandma actually kill them? I, I'm so confused. I feel like replaying that chapter just so that I can see... Um... You know what? Screw it. We're gonna, we're gonna replay that last chapter and we're going to see... We're gonna see what hap- oh, oh, okay, I'm all the way back here. You know what? It's fine. We're gonna see what happens if we let them all out. Jump! Okay, there we go. We have so many stairs to go down. I just want to see what the other ending is. That is- I- I waited for this ending for so long, and I only feel a sense of disappointment. Because it doesn't explain what I need explained about the King of Mirrors. What did the King of Mirrors want? Okay, there we go, we fell. What did he want with me and my family, and why, why does he want to come through the mirrors? What sort of hold does he have over the town, and why? Eh, oh, come on. Okay, we'll start with Mom. Let Mom out! Oh, it just breaks the mirror. Let Dad out! Let Big Brother out! Let Grandma out! Okay, what happened? So shiny. Are they gonna explode? Oh. Here he comes! Okay, so I'm assuming he's gonna come through and kill me now. There he is. He comes through. Wait. I went into the mirror. Uh huh. Well, that doesn't explain anything either. Am I stuck in the mirrors now? Do I live in the shadow world? What happened? Like, obviously, it was a bait and I didn't get my parents back or my brother. But it's like, okay, so is. Does he, 
Did we do a body swap? Is this a Freaky Friday situation? Is he me now and I'm going to have to like watch him destroy people? Did he need my body? Is it is it all in my head and mentally I was the only person who's like whose body he was compatible with because I can like talk to the dead and by by weakening myself with my love for my family is that what finally caused the barrier I chose my family over this life? I am I'm not satisfied with this ending. And I waited so long. I've waited months. Months and months and months. I'm not I'm not satisfied with my service. <laughs> Oh, what if Eva? What is that? Or is it EVA? I might. I don't. I don't know what to think because I honestly thought I was gonna have at least like three chapters left, but I had to replay chapter twelve, and then it was chapter thirteen and the epilogue, and I f I feel I feel gypped. Because I was so invested in this story from the beginning, and the gameplay mechanics were really good, and it was unique, and I really felt like there was going to be like a really good story to it, and I was let down. Like, it was good, except for all the questions that it leaves you with. Like, once again, who is the King of Mirrors? What does he want with these people? They follow him like a like a cult. Although I guess since he's the King of Mirrors, I can understand like how he was reaching out to people was like through the mirrors. But then also the neighbor. It her tarot reading said she was still alive, so she she was marked for death because she had a, a date of death. But it was in the future, so it's like oh I'm gonna possess you and then go kill your neighbor lady like. I don't understand, but also, wasn't she arrested for the murder of her grandson? So I don't understand how that works. Also, why did grandma kill my parents? You know, they said it was so that she could use me later, but I feel like, why? Then why tell me about any of it? Why not just have me experience this and instead of being like, oh, this dude's probably evil. Like, why lead me through all of this? I'm having a moment. This game has put me into gamer crisis. I'm so upset. I, I wanted better. I deserved better. Like, this was one of, like, the games that I was looking forward to the most. And I just... <sighs> I have been let down. But... I guess that was prognostic, and now it's done, and tell me what you think in the comments. This episode will be up on YouTube tomorrow, so please, please, please feel free to go over to my YouTube channel linked on Twitch and let me know what you think in the comments, because I, I'm really curious if anybody feels as disappointed as I do, because I, words cannot describe at the moment just how I'm feeling. Well, I, I guess this is what it is, but I will be back tomorrow with another episode of my Discord member's choice. So until then, I hope everyone has a fantastic evening, and I hope to see you then. Bye! <laughs>